fake lawsuit. Is it tough to, to have to protect your, your image? And the story behind Jennifer's short-haired new look. ...that revealing and private videotapes of her were going to be made public. E.T.'s Leonard Malton talks to the star about that controversy and her new look. Is it tough to, to have to sort of protect your life, protect your, your image everywhere you turn around? Jennifer's legal team quickly filed suit after rumors spread that rapper and Fresario Marion Suge Knight was planning to market an alleged sex video of Jennifer with a former boyfriend on the internet. Knight is a rival of her high-profile ex, Sean Combs. And after Knight's attorneys denied that he had such a tape, the lawsuit was withdrawn. This is why they made lawyers, so you don't have to get involved with this stuff and just get rid of it, and then that's it. Jennifer had a new look for the movie's premiere here in Hollywood, but the same date who accompanied her to the Oscars. Jennifer arrived at Angel Eyes with boyfriend Chris Judd, but it was her new pinned-up curly hairdo that was grabbing all the attention. Now, how would you describe your fashion statement tonight? This, you know, we were kind of inspired by the whole angel vibe, so it's kind of like a, kind of like a rock and roll angel, I guess. Every time I close my eyes, I see that damn gun. In Angel Eyes, opening Friday, Chicago policewoman Jennifer is saved by mysterious stranger Jim Caviezel, and the encounter leads to romance. It's more of a real life love story of two people, regular people who kind of find themselves, heal each other through love. Jennifer will appear in a concert special for NBC this fall, and she'll produce a sitcom loosely based on her life growing up in the Bronx. It, it'll be more of like um, kind of a Wonder Years, put from a girl's perspective, you know, yep. young girl, a lot of dreams. Thanks, Leonard. Mind you, Jennifer won't be starring in that NBC comedy, and as yet, there is no premiere date. Robert Blake murdered as she faced a flashbulb frenzy at the premiere of Angel Eyes, sporting a new look. <laughs> With boyfriend Chris Judd by her side, the couple wore matching purple outfits, but it was her new short do that sent tongues wagging. I also like your hair, Dad. I know you didn't cut it, but a lot of people think you cut it. You no, did I didn't cut it. It's just pinned up. I want to understand you, but I can't do that if you don't let me in. In the drama Angel Eyes, Jennifer stars as a Chicago street cop whose life takes an unexpected turn when she falls in love with a mysterious stranger who saves her from certain death. Up-and-comer Jim Caviezel plays her love interest, and Jennifer told me it was the first time he'd ever done a movie love scene. I wasn't sure if he had ever done one. And that's usually my luck, you know what I mean? I always get these guys who, like, instead of, like, helping me do it, you know, I have to kind of help them do it because they've never done it before. She uh, asked me, she says, is this your first love scene? I said, well, is, am I that bad? After the premiere, I sat down with Jennifer to discuss reports that rap mogul Marion Suge Knight allegedly had a tape of her having sex with an ex-boyfriend, a report Knight denied. You went to court to, to block the distribution of an alleged tape that somebody supposedly had of you. You know, it's just all so stupid, and that's why I have lawyers. I don't really, really even get into all of that. But you are known, like I said, as somebody that you don't mess with. Mm -hmm. Did you say, look, you're not going to intimidate me, whatever this is? There's yeah. nothing to be intimidated by, you know what I mean? It's just, it's who I am, that's who you are. We have a pro Lawyers, that's okay. what they're for. All right, thank you, Jennifer. And Angel Eyes opens Friday when it goes head-to-head -head with Shrek. Nancy O'Dell is in New York with some Shrekies right now. Hey, Nancy. It's Friday. Nancy, bye.